Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Ithaca High School, Ken Manning, Western Wisconsin Video Productions, as we bring you the homecoming football game as the Bulldogs host the Bulldogs. That's right, Ithaca hosting Boscobel here in the annual Saturday afternoon homecoming football game. And the Bulldogs of Boscobel will be kicking off. And here's the approach. This game underway, and it's a booming kick coming down at about the five-yard line. A great kick here. And bringing the ball back. Oh, a great return so far here. And now breaking free. This is number 11. He's going to step out of bounds. That was a great run by Channing Brown. Brown comes away with a huge run back. Boy, that was, let's see, there's 45. Make it a 55, almost a 55. Make it a 58-yard return here by Brown. And the Bulldogs are on the, on the march right away, it looks like, with excellent field position. Well, it's the 100th annual homecoming here. The fair and everything else. I tell you what, it was a great parade. Here's the handoff and looking to turn the corner. It's got to the outside. Might have picked up about three yards on the play. That was number five in uh, Matthew Kepler, Jr. Bulldogs getting that great run back. Now setting themselves up here for, going to try and set themselves up for some success in the opening series. Bulldogs of Boscobel in their white tops and gray pants. Here's the handoff. This is going to go to Lincoln Manning, trying to get to the outside, and he's ripped down after a gain of a couple. couple yards on that one. It's going to bring up a maybe even one. They got just on the other side of the 35. And it's going to bring up a third. And we're going to say six. Third and six here. Good job by the Bulldogs of Boscobel as they were able to string that play out. Manning really not able to get around the corner. They'll put man in motion. That was uh, Brown, I believe. They'll throw the ball out here in the flat to Brown. He'll make the catch, and he's slammed to the uh, turf here. Good coverage, <laughs> 21 in Stuart Trum. Brown with the reception and knocking on the door for the first down. A couple of yards short brings up a... Fourth and two situation now as the play comes in from the sideline. That was Xander Jones bringing the play in. Jones a junior. Check that. Jones is a sophomore. They'll split him way out here to the uh, near side. Quarterback on his own going to take it himself and it's going to be stopped cold. A direct snap back to Wesley Nelson and no place to go. And the Bulldogs of Boscobel will take over first and 10 going the other way. Boscobel comes up to the line of scrimmage. Let's take a look and see if we can catch uh, their quarterback. They'll put a man in motion, and they're going to go with a little flea flicker. And coming out here, a chance for the reception, and it's caught. Down to the 40. A little uh, flea flicker type play, halfback option. And the throw goes to 21, and Stuart Trum, who makes a nice grab, got behind that Ithaca defense. He had to wait for the ball, though, and Ithaca was able to get the, get the stop, but not until a big, big-time play right there. Let's see, that throw was by number three also in Lucas uh, Whitaker. Take a look here now, quarterbacking. Staying in that shotgun formation. Going to keep it himself. Trying to go right up the middle, and he stopped cold. Got to the 30. It'll be a loss of one on the play. Trying to see if that is... Uh, I wonder if that's T.J. Bell. Let's see who the quarterback is here. It could be Mozoff. 
Carter Molzoff trying to look for him. He's only a freshman though. Uh, coming out here to the near side, that was a quarter, uh, number three with the throw and a nice job on the reception and then got to the 35 yard line. So a pickup of about four on the play. That throw coming by Lucas Whitaker and I think Lucas is the quarterback for the most part. <clears throat> so third and six now for the Boscobel squad. Whitaker about five yards back, waiting for that shotgun snap. Bobbled for a second, got the handoff, and the run going forward, We're gonna get to the 30, close to the first down. Gonna be about a yard short here, just a half yard short. A place the ball right on the 30. So fourth and short here now for Boscobel as they make the decision to go for it here. Deep in Ithaca territory. Whitaker bobbled the ball on the snap just for a moment and when he recovered, Boscobell in the end was half a yard shy of that first down. Let's see if the Bulldogs of Ithaca can make the stop and that won't happen as they'll jump the gun here. That was 34 and Wesley Nelson on the hard count stepped across. And they'll get a fresh set of downs here, Will Boscobell, as the ball is spotted on the 25 of Ithaca. First and 10. Boscobell comes up to the line of scrimmage. 61 is their center in uh, Jaron Wiki. Man in motion, the handoff. No, it is a handoff, and uh, go, what a spin move there. And then slammed again to the turf. 24 in Breyer Wayne. Tried to make a move, and when he made that little spin move, that's when he really got hit rather, uh, rather hard. That'll bring up a second down and nine. Maybe a yard, not quite. They'll split a man out to the far side in Muldrum. And here on the near side, 21 in Trum. Again, Whitaker will send, uh, put Trum in motion, turn the handoff to Trum. No place to go, trying to make the most of it. And there he's stopped. It's going to be a loss on the play. Trum ran into a couple of Bulldogs of Ithaca, 5 and 34 here. Five is Kepler, 34, and Wesley Nelson. So a third down situation here now. I'm going to call it third and 14, which sounds about right. Boscobel trying to make a bit of a run. There's a fumble on the snap and a smart move over there by Wayne as he just fell on the ball and that was the best thing you could do. That was, that had ugly wrote all over it. So fourth and 14 now. Ithaca will bring in a extra back it looks like in Micah Salisbury. To the far side, to the near. Now under some pressure. Whitaker dropping back, looking for some help. He's going to let go of the ball, and it's incomplete. We've got a flag on the play here. Flag was thrown at about the 42, 43-yard line. We'll see what that's all about. It's going to be a hold call. Ithaca will decline that one, and it'll be first and 10 going the other way. Ithaca coming up with the ball here in their second possession of the ball game. Starts on their own 34. 
facing Boscobel here. Dropping back, looking to pass. Here's a shot out to the near side and dropped. Nelson had his uh, receiver and Logan Anderson open and Logan just couldn't pull it down in time. He did have some pressure coming up here. That was uh, 21 in Trum was all around him. Nelson, a sophomore quarterback. Turns, hands off. This is uh, should be Brown, and oh boy, he's uh, brought down quickly here, right on the 35-yard line. Nice tackle there by Whitaker, playing defensive back. Kepler, excuse me, that was Kepler with the run. And it's... A third and long situation here for, for Ithaca once again. Nelson dropping back. He's going to go long. He's got his man open, and it is caught. That was uh, Lincoln Manning with the catch. Boy, that was a nice grab there by Manning as he got up in the air and pulled that one down. He broke free from his defender and was backpedaling, going up in the air to make the grab. First and 10 on a nice play. Ithaca moving from their... 34, now it's number 34, and Nelson trying to get around the corner. He's able to do so, and he picks up another first down. We got a flag, though, back here on about the 40-yard uh, line in that territory. It's going to be a hold call here, maybe a block in the back. We'll have to wait and see. It's going to push Ithaca back, though, and so that run will be retracted here off from the miscue. They'll talk things over and get ready to step it off here. All the way back here. They'll wind the clock up. I never did see the uh, infraction signal. First and 20. Nelson again with the shotgun. He'll turn hand off. This is going to be Kepler. He sneaks through, and wow. A toss to the ground by Gavin Hill, but not before a nice little run here of about nine yards. So a... Uh, about a nine yard pickup here. Brings up second and 11 here for Ithaca. Nelson waiting for the snap. It's a good one. He rolls here to the near side. Got a little bit more of a wide turn than he wanted and now he's pushed out of bounds here. And a late flag coming in. That's probably going to be a late hit. Somebody came in and clipped him just a little bit after he'd stepped out. So that's going to be a personal foul. They also said there was a horse collar tackle as well. That's going to go against Boscobel, and that will cost him a big one. Going to step that one off. That's a 15-yarder. First and 10 now for Ithaca with 2.07 to go in this first quarter of action. Center, I believe, is uh, Ethan Cutcroft. That's who it is. 
Nelson looking, fires, caught out there in the about five yards and turn, and that's going to be a second and five situation. Go five, turn on a quick hook, and the reception, the ball was right there. Bringing the play in, this is going to be Kepler once again, rotating with a Xander Jones for the Bulldogs of Ithaca. Nelson surveys the field. Good snap, handoff, nothing going here. Trying to break free and is able to do so first for a second and then he's wrestled down. So a loss on the play, Logan Anderson, no place to go. That was uh, Thomas who came up with the stop and it's a, gonna be a long third down play coming up here. Third and about 15 here for Ithaca. They get together and ready to get things going. Breaking from the huddle. Kepler split out the far side, dropping back under some pressure. Here's the throw, it is broken up. Trying to hit Jones coming across the middle and a nice defensive play over there by Boscobel. Well timed, and now it's a fourth down and 15. Bringing the play in, number four in Micah Salisbury. Good snap, big rush, and tipped at the throw. They set up the inside pass and to no avail. Boscobel able to touch the ball and it's a first and 10 going the other way. Well, the inside screen pass not able to work here and Boscobel will take over first and 10. Ithaca handing the ball back over after their second possession. 33 seconds remaining in this First quarter of action, here comes the pitch to the far side, trying to make the corner, able to make a turn, but just barely getting back to the line of scrimmage. Maybe a yard pickup is all that they're gonna have. And we should be, that should be, I would imagine, the last play of quarter number one. Looks like that's what's gonna happen here as they kind of stand there and watch the clock run down. We're down to five seconds and we will take ourselves a break here when we look for quarter number two coming up in just a moment's time. Well, back we come here to Ithaca. Boscobel with the ball here, second and nine as we begin quarter number two. Dropping back, looking, here's a ball thrown. It's gonna be, we're gonna get a flag right down here in the middle and I think they're gonna call this on uh, 61 in Waki, I think they're gonna get him for a hold call here. He tackled Lincoln Manning in the line. Manning had uh, two guys on him and one definitely holding on to him after being tackled and he's the nose guard on the defense. Whitaker splits the men out on both sides of them. Pumps once, now twice. Ball is incomplete as he went over to that far sideline looking for number 11 and TJ Bell. Bell had that one kind of thrown behind him a little bit and he just couldn't quite get the hand around it.
third and 20 now. Ithaca's defense looking to try and make a stop here and get the ball back. Whitaker, straight drop under some pressure. Here's that inside screen and it's not gonna work. What a job there by Ithaca. Somebody stayed home. That might have been number 58 in that linebacker position. We don't have the uh, name uh, for the young man, but he played that one pretty well, number 58. And it's gonna be a fourth and 15. Whitaker will punt and uh, drop him back. Let's see if we can pick up. One of them is uh, Brown, Channing Brown, number 11. He's on the far side. Here's the approach. It's a pretty good kick floating down and it's a fair catch call and it will be made by 22 in Xander Jones. Ithaca taking over here. This will be their third possession of the ball game. Still no score. We're sitting here at zeros in this homecoming game. Nelson puts Manning in motion. Here's the handoff. Oh, what a big hole right here. Got around the corner. And it's going to be a score for Ithaca. From the 46-yard line, a quick jaunt there by number 24 in Logan Anderson. He got the corner and outraced the defense. And Ithaca will take the lead here. Why, well, I tell you what, uh, the second play from the line of scrimmage here, was it? Dropping back, it's gonna be Micah Salisbury looking for the extra point kick here. We'll pan back. Kick is a line drive kick and it was underneath. They're saying it was under. Boy, I tell you what, it looked like it was over, just over. But uh, that's not the way they saw it. We'll take a quick break. Six nothing your score here. Lincoln Manning set to kick for Ithaca. The approach, it's a line drive kick coming down. Boy, a good shot here. Oh, slipping on the turf. That was uh, 58 in John O'Neill. One of the wide receivers. Looked like they were gonna go with a little reverse action. And uh, when he made that turn, the feet went right out from underneath them. Here comes Boscobel now, three men out here on the near side. They'll toss the ball out this direction and it's gonna be incomplete. Trying to go up after number 11 in TJ Bell and he couldn't come up with a grab. Well, back to the action, we come here. Whitaker looking to go downfield. He lofts one up into the air, it's caught and brought down quickly. Over there on the defensive side, that was Garcia Bolin helping out a freshman. Making the grab was Bell. Logan Anderson uh, had to be helped off the field a moment ago, and they're working on him. Hopefully. Nothing too terrible there, as he was the one who came up with that 46 yard touchdown run. Whitaker under some pressure and down he goes. Slicing in. Well, I tell you what, uh, staying low, that was 51 and Marshall Self, and he was able to use some, uh, I always wanna say he's using some wrestling skills on that one.
Well, Anderson is back up, kind of jogging a little bit there. He might have just uh, turned that ankle a little bit too much. But uh, looks like he's going to try and make a go of things. Now a illegal procedure here, jumping the gun. Boscobel will be pushed back five more yards on this punt situation. And now it's going to be like fourth and 20 all the way back to the 10. So looking for better field position off from that flag. Ithaca with their men back deep right around the 40-yard uh, line. Here's the approach. Whitaker's kick oh, end over end. It's going to be a short kick out of bounds. And Ithaca is going to be in great position here as they will attempt to come up with another score here in quarter number two. Well, the kick off the side of the foot of Whitaker gives Ithaca great field position. It's going to be first and 10. Ball just right on that 15-yard line. Nelson with the turn, the handoff, and up the middle and running into a wall of Boscobel Bulldogs. That was uh, Bolin. Big stop right there by Alex Trum, a junior, playing in that uh, defensive line. I tell you what, he was uh, a stalwart right there on that play. Good snap. Here's a quick pitch to the outside and trying to get around the corner. I know Boscoville played that one very well once again. That was 24 in Wayne with the stop. Trying to get around the corner was Kepler. There's no place to go as Boscoville strung that play out defensively. So third and nine here now. Now we're gonna get a flag here. Somebody on Ithaca's side did not have their chin strap snapped. So that's a five yard penalty. Nelson comes out of the huddle and gets the quick call here from head coach Steve Olson. Good snap. Nelson a little reverse to Manning and he broke one out. It's a flea flicker. He's got a man wide open and it's caught. Whoa, what a throw there by Lincoln Manning. He sidestepped a tackle from Gavin Hill kept his balance and threw a dart for the touchdown. Channing Brown on the receiving end of that one. Ithaca looking for the two point conversion. Looking, quick toss over here, and Kepler all by himself. He'll get in easily. Bulldogs of Ithaca now on top. 14-0 here as we take a little break. 7.23 to go here, quarter number two. Well, Lincoln Manning will look to kick off here after the Bulldogs picked up the touchdown pass from him to uh, Brown. There's a fumble. Scooped it back up, though. That is, again, number 11 in Bell. Trying to go down that far sideline, and he's going to get pushed out of bounds right around the 25, 26 yard line. And that's where Boscovell will take over here as the clock runs with 7.05 to go here in this first half action. We'll stop the clock here at the 7.03 mark. Whitaker with the 
inside handoff and brought down quickly after a couple of yards in that interior line and a good job by that linebacking crew for Ithaca. He'll be in on the stop, they say. I believe that is, uh, he's number 61. They have 31 in the lineup, but uh, the program. Whitaker under some duress and down he goes. All kinds of uh, Ithaca Bulldogs around the corner. Leading the charge in there in the interior side of things was uh, Manning. He'll be as well. So third and 12 now for Boscobel, and they'll break the huddle with two here to the near side. Thomas and Bell coming in late is Hill, and now a timeout needs to be called. Whitaker realized that time was running out. They'll take their first stop here at 5.52 to go. Ithaca out in front, 14-0. Coming right back, ready for the action here after the timeout. Whitaker surveying the field again. He split two men out here to the near, two to the far. Lone back behind him. Good snap. Ithaca on the pressure once again, and Whitaker is pushed to the outside. He'll let go, and he has his man caught at about the 42 yard line. Wow, what a job there by Whitaker, and he threw a strike to Stuart Trum for the first down. On the tackle, the coverage by Kepler, but sneaking into a safe spot, Trump comes up with the reception. First and 10 on the 42. Quick toss out here in the flat. Good sidestep move. And then the tackle coming up here. That was Hilby with the stop. Bell with a quick little move, sidestepped one. Would be tackler. Here's the handoff, and again, that Ithaca interior line doing a nice job. In on the legs, Manning coming up with the uh, ankles. Had an ankle lace on him there, and then uh, got some help from the buddies in that linebacking crew making the stop. And it's third and 10 here with no gain. Boscobel with trips here on the near side and two on the far. Looking here on the flat, they've got their man. And now the stop, boy, good job on the coverage. Only a gain of about two on the play. Thomas all of a sudden had three Ithaca Bulldogs around him. No place to go, it's fourth down. Whitaker dropping back as if in punt formation. And the Bulldogs will send back Brown and Jones. Good snap. The kick is a nice kick coming out. It's going to be a fair catch here. And that's where Ithaca will take over. Jones. On that line drive kick says, we'll, we'll play it from here. 
Ball's going to be spotted about the uh, 20, I want to say it's around that 27 yard line or so. And it'll be first and 10, Ithaca. Ithaca comes up to the line of scrimmage with a 14 nothing lead at the 304 mark here in this first half action. A good snap coming up here to Nelson. He'll run the ball straight ahead and pick up about four yards on the play. Brings up a second and six situation here now as doing a good job. They're gonna give him five on the play. Second and five. Logan Anderson back into the ball game now. Good to see right behind Nelson sitting back. Here's a quick toss out to uh, Manning in the flat and that ball fell short. So second down, it's gonna make it third down now. That ball never got to Manning as he was out on that uh, far sideline. And the ball, a couple yards short on him, skipping by him. Well, I think uh, that's going to be an interesting one. The other guy, I think, moved. It was, uh, well, they're going to give it on uh, Boscobel first, making the move, and then that's why he'll be moved. So third and one now. So it was, it was actually uh, third and six, not... Not third and five. <laughs> and the Bulldogs of Ithaca will take a time out here. 2.28 to go here with the first half action. We'll do the same. Ithaca Bulldogs come up to the line of scrimmage. Nelson will go right up under center and he's gonna try and come up with a quarterback keeper. See if he can get that one yard. It's gonna be pretty close here as Boscobel really did a good job, but no, they're gonna give it to him. Line judge over here and uh, Bruce Kaiser said, yeah, from this direction, he's got it. First and 10 for Ithaca. Clock continuing to move here as we approach the two minute mark in this first half. Out in front, 14 nothing. Back to the shotgun formation. Nelson looking, he's gonna fire downfield. It's deep and it's gonna be knocked down. Boy, I tell you what, pretty good job defending there on the play with uh, Lucas Whitaker, who's the quarterback. He had to play a defensive back obviously right there and knocked it down. Tried to get the ball to uh, Micah Salisbury for Ithaca. Just under a couple minutes to go now with the clock stop off from the incomplete pass. Bowling here on the near side. Under some pressure, they'll come down the field. It's gonna be intercepted. That was uh, Whitaker with the interception. He had to play a little hot potato with it. And he was able to pull it down. And Boscobel was in great shape here to try and put a score on the board. Boscobel in good shape now. A minute 48 to go. They've got a couple of timeouts as they sit in Ithaca territory. Now under some pressure, they're going to throw that one away as charging down on the play. That was uh, Ethan Cockroft putting a whole bunch of pressure on Lucas Whitaker. After that interception by Whitaker, he was able to get the ball back to the 32 yard line. And that's where we're gonna get a timeout here on the uh, second and 10 for Boscobel. They wanna talk things over. Coming out of the timeout, both, both Bulldog teams come up to the line of scrimmage, ready to go. It's second and 10 
Fake the handoff, another handoff, and now under some pressure and down he goes. Ball was loose, but they're gonna say his knee was down after Ithaca came in. Kepler on the uh, stop. Now we're gonna get a flag here. That might be a little bit of an attitude here. <laughs> I'm afraid as it goes on Ithaca. That's gonna be a personal foul, unsportsmanlike. Yep, that's a big one. That's going to give him 15 for Boscobel. And a second and much more manageable play compared to what it was going to be. It stepped off. Uh, well, now they bring the ball back. I'm not sure what happened there. Well, it's third. They've got uh, third down, yes. Third and about 14. I thought it was gonna be second and very short. <laughs> Whitaker goes out here to the near, far side, excuse me. And there is uh, Manning coming back. Manning teaming up here. Also slowing the play down. Fifth. 58, gonna get his uh, Berkham, there we are, Caleb Berkham. Berkham with the initial hit and Manning came in to finish things off. Fourth and 15 for Boscobel. And there's a good jump on the hard count. A good hard count causing the jump is how I should say it. That was uh, Ethan Cockroft here on the defensive end position. Looking to try and get an angle and unfortunately jumped over. And it'll be a five yard penalty. It's fourth and 12 now instead of fourth and 17. Time running out here for Boscobel. And we're gonna get a timeout. Boscobel calling their last timeout. Just under seven seconds to go here in the half. Whitaker comes back with the Line up, ready to go. He's going to drop back. He's in big trouble. And down he goes, Manning in there on the hit. Wow. One second remaining, and Whitaker took a hard shot. Going in for the uh, tackle. He's trying to swipe at the ball as, as well and dropped Whitaker. Well, one second remaining here. And a 14-0 lead for Ithaca. Let's see if the uh, Bulldogs will just take the knee here and call it a half. And that's what they do. 14 nothing your score here. We'll take a break and come back. Second half action coming right up.
Cardinals, a safe tonight by the game, along with coaching numerous all-conference players. He coached three players selected to all-star game and never had a losing season as head coach. Selected Richard Valley head coach of the year six times and Richard Valley assistant coach of the year once, along with all district assistant coach of the year. He enjoyed teaching the game to the English students and says he loved practice more than the game. Ladies and gentlemen, the newest athletic Hall of Fame member, Chad Clay. Back we come to Ithaca as we get set for second half action. Lincoln Manning with the hand raised. Here's the approach. It's a line drive kick coming down to Whitaker. Or check that. It might be, a, we'll get the number in just a second here. That's a good, pretty good return coming up here by number 11 and TJ Bell. Bell with the snag. He picked it up at around the five yard line, maybe the seven and comes back here and they spot the ball in the 29 so a 20 plus yard return and Boscobel sitting at first and 10 trailing 14 nothing here the Bulldogs of Boscobel taking on the Ithaca Bulldogs annual homecoming game here and uh, boy I tell you what uh, how many years they have played up here on this field I fondly remember those games. Here's the, uh, especially the senior year when we played all of our home games up here. Prior to that, we were playing at uh, Crosscup Park where Richmond Center Hornets, when they were away and they had things scheduled out that way. So kind of kind of a unique situation, but we always did play our homecoming game up here. We had no lights, so that's why, why we were always... Uh, somewhere else or in Richland Center. That was back in the 73 season, 73-74 senior year. Now that I've dated myself, let's go back to the ball game. Here is uh, Bell, oh he fumbles the ball and it's gonna be Boscobell will maintain possession here as they go out of bounds. Ball bounces out. Boscobell will pick up a first down here. Bell with a good hole. Had the ball popped out, but Ithaca could not reach it. Split out here to the near side is Muldrum. 
And in the slot, this is uh, Whitaker, number three. Let's take a look. It's going to be Bell doing the quarterback. He keeps it himself, comes here to the near side, and he's pulled out of bounds. Cockroft in on the stop. Well, I tell you what, that was a nice job by Cockroft as he was able to fight off that block and kind of extend the play as well as make the stop. Good work here for Ithaca. They'll keep the clock moving as they have the tackle just inside the playing field. Whitaker will go back to the quarterback position here. Shotgun behind him again, 24 in Wayne. Three men on the far side with trips rolling that what direction. Here comes Manning chasing him and he's gonna get him. Lincoln Manning chases down Whitaker and a big time loss. Ithaca Bulldogs coming up huge on that play. Manning zeroed in on him and had to kick it into a little afterburner there to catch Whitaker, who was trying to escape. And he just couldn't outrun him. Out here to the near side is Trum. Whitaker turns, looks to pitch. He does, and nothing happening. Ithaca all over that play. And a huge loss here. Gavin Hill pulled down and Boscoville going the wrong way. It is fourth and forever. Fourth and 31 and Whitaker will drop back to kick. Boscoville, I should say, uh, will punt the ball away and Ithaca look to pick up good field position here on this potential punt. Good snap. The approach, pretty good kick. It's going to float down a fair catch called for and taken at the 49 of Ithaca. That's where the Bulldogs of the home team will take over here with a 14-0 lead at the 840 mark. Ithaca will come up. Nelson with a good snap, turns, hands off. This is going to be Kepler. He breaks through the line, got to the outside, and now he's looking to get off to the races, pulled down from behind. Boy, what a job over there. That was Gavin Hill. Had a good angle, and he was able to get there just in time to keep a touchdown run from occurring. And we got a flag back here, though, on about the... 42 yard line. We're going to see what that's all about. Coming back on the Ithaca squad. And they're going to step that one off. Well, a tough break there as Kepler had a whole lot of running room. From the point of infraction, it comes back. It's going to be first and about 11. Well, they'll try again. Good snap, got a flag here on this particular play. Trying to get to the outside. Nelson is gonna be pulled down on the stop. We're gonna go illegal procedure call here on Ithaca. Boscobell in on the tackle. That was Trum once again. Well, they're gonna go back five more yards here, I believe. And it'll be uh, first and about 16 for Ithaca.
Good snap. A lot of pressure and it's a good catch here. This is Kepler trying to get the outside on a little screen. Got a lot of room here and now still on his feet. Another flag, two flags on the play. My goodness. Well, those kind of mistakes, just uh, you need a little more discipline is all. Let's see, if, especially if it goes against Ithaca here. Got to know when to uh, go after somebody from a blocking standpoint and when to say, well, hey, they got the angle on me. They beat me to the spot. They'll walk this one off. It's probably going to be enough for the first down. It is. It'll still be a first down play, but... Not quite where they wanted it to be. They have to go with a first and 10 with 7.25 to go in quarter number three. Clock continuing to move here. Handoff. This is going to be Anderson trying to get to the outside. And, uh, well, he's on his feet and pushed out of bounds past us where we can get to them. And we'll wait to see where they mark the ball. Good job here by Anderson. And it was good to see him with the run after coming out earlier in the ball game that first half. Well, we'll probably go a little bit of an angle here if we need to, but we'll see if we can't pick up the play especially if they come to the right side. Looking downfield, here's a throw down the middle, and it is caught. Lincoln Manning comes up with a miraculous catch for the touchdown. Sanders between a couple of defenders, and Manning still able to pull it away and drop into the end zone. Ithaca will look for the extra point kick. Kick is up. That one is no good off to the right-hand side. And we'll sit at a 20-0 score here. 20 nothing. Ithaca over Boscobel. Lincoln Manning will kick off here after picking up that touchdown reception from Nelson. That was probably, what, about a 25, 30-yard touchdown toss. Probably even a little further, but uh, that kick goes into the end zone. Nice boot by Manning. And Bosco will take over on their own 20-yard line. Well, back we come here to Ithaca. Lucas Whitaker, shotgun formation. He's a lone man. And under some pressure, he sidestepped Lincoln Manning and then wound up going right into the arms of uh, number 66 here. And I believe uh, that was, I think that was uh, Cleary in there, maybe John. And now Boscobel will take a timeout. Taking a look here at the scoreboard, you can see 20 nothing your score here. Ithaca over Boscobel. Boscobel off from the timeout will step up to the line of scrimmage, as will Ithaca. Handoff up the middle, and boy, nothing happening there as that hole was stuffed. Initial hit in there. Looked like it was, uh, let's see if there's a number 60, I believe, as uh, that was a good stop with Caden uh, Coleman. Number 60 and Lincoln Manning, number 20. Putting that play to rest. And a loss on that one makes it third and 16.
Whitaker will split out now as a receiver. Let's see if this is uh, Bell. Whitaker in motion. Bell will look and take it himself, and he is not going to go anywhere. Brought down quickly. Tell you what, a lot of uh, players yet. Hilby, Cockroft, you name them. They were all coming in after Bell. And it's going to bring up a fourth and 17, a couple of yard loss on the play. And Bosque Bell will look to kick it away here. They think a leading 20 to nothing, looking to get the ball back. Good snap and an end over end kick coming down here. And on the uh, pickup, it's going to be Brown, and now he's driven out of bounds. Well, a return of about maybe close to 10 yards gives Ithaca great field position. Here's Nelson dropping back right away. He has his man in Manning with the catch and pushed out of bounds. A good reception here. A quick little five yard down and out. And uh, he'll pick up about four on the play. He'll split uh, Channing Brown out here to the near side. Handoff. This is Anderson trying to get away, but tell you what, uh, pretty good job there by number 11 and TJ Bell playing a great defensive stance right there to make the stop. After maybe a couple of yards, it'll bring up a third and four. Xander Jones bringing the play in. The snap, the handoff, Kepler with the run, and he is brought down. Bell for one. Also in there on the stop was 58 and John O'Neill. Jilson helping out. Three of the Boscobel members greeting the runner here for the stop. 3.05 and moving for the clock. Nelson with a good snap looking. He's going to go to the far side. It's caught and brought down quickly here. Enough for the first down. Brown able to reach up and grab that one and then he was hogtied to the ground. They're going to give him the first down. Tell you what, that was a nice little pass from Wesley Nelson. Sophomore quarterback. They got him around for a couple more years. Ball is spotted on the 22 of Boscobel. Handoff. Nothing happening there. Kepler brought down by Bell. Check that. It was uh, actually, I believe it was Trum. Number uh, number 10? Oh, it's Hill. There we go. Hill doing the job. Direct snap, and Nelson's going to run forward. He's going to pick up a couple yards here. Pretty tough yards at that. In on the stop. Well, there's Bell once again down on the bottom. Got some help with Alex Trum. Two or three, 
And we got to give some credit to uh, John O'Neill, who is able to stand up Nelson a little bit. And then the others were ready to come in and help out. Nelson dropping back. He's going to look downfield. He fires over the middle, and it's caught. On the reception, I believe that was uh, Xander Jones. That's who it was. Good uh, job protecting the ball. Got the body between the ball and the defender who was coming up strong. So first and go here as Ithaca knocking on the door on the seven. Now the yard marker, they got to get that changed to one. He's got it on uh, three. It's the third quarter, but not, not third and goal. It's first and goal. Anderson up the uh, on the side here, off tackle, and he's in for the score. From seven yards away, Logan Anderson picking up the touchdown run, and Ithaca scoots out in front, 26-0. Now the extra point kick will be attempted here, we would imagine. Well, the trainer is going to go across to, to the basketball side as one of their Bulldog players. A little tougher time getting up there, and they're going to make sure he's okay. Now they're ready for the extra point kick here. Kick is up, and it is no good. Off to the right. Salisbury with a good leg, but that time it went... Off to the right for the second time. 26 nothing. your score, 16 seconds remaining here in the third quarter. Lincoln Manning ready for the kickoff as the officials get set. Put the last one into the uh, end zone on a pretty good line drive kick. This one not going to happen here. A big pickup, and uh, that was O'Neill with the pickup. He comes back and is stopped. Pretty good field position for Boscobel, though, as they uh, take over here. See if we have one more play left in this third quarter, or, you know, there could be a couple if they drop back and pass and maybe don't complete it. Modrum is split out here to the near side. In the slot, let's take a look here. I believe that is uh, Stuart Trum. Whitaker takes a look. They're going to toss one out here. That is Trum, and he is going to be stopped here. In there on the uh, help with the tackle was Kepler. And that's going to do it. End of quarter number four, or excuse me, of number three. We're going to move to quarter number four in just a couple of moments as they take the break and change sides of the field. Bulldogs of Ithaca, their homecoming annual game out in front, 26 nothing. They're on the defensive side, and they come up with a nice stop here on the potential carry. Wayne stopped after a short gain. Third and eight now. They go quick formation here. Whitaker rolling out in trouble, and now he will push the ball out of bounds here. Good catch by one of the fans here for the Bulldogs. Thank you. 
Whitaker will look to kick the ball away. Now they're ready. Whitaker waiting for the snap. It's a good one, chest high, and the kick is away. That one's going to come down and fly out of bounds. Let's see where they mark it. It's going to be somewhere around that, uh, between that 45 and 50-yard line. They're going to spot it, looks like, on about the 45. Well, now the official is still moving down. They're going to go back. He stopped at the 45. Now they're going to go back into Ithaca territory. All right. Well, that's still not bad field position here for Ithaca as they spot the ball in the 47. Bulldogs up to the line of scrimmage with Nelson, the quarterback. He's going to keep this one himself, trying to get to the outside, and he's very close to making that turn. There it is. And he's going to pick up a nice gain here. He's going to get a first down. Well, I'll tell you what, he was a sidestep to tackle. Wayne in on the tackle for Boscobel. Ithaca with the first down. Bring in a couple of new players here. They're rotating the play in. Bolin will split here to the near side. Nice quick snap. Dropping, firing, caught, Manning. Broke to the outside, now still on his feet. Going to be brought down by a couple of uh, defenders here. A nice catch and run for Lincoln Manning and a first down. Yeah, he picked up about 15 on that one, it looked like. Maybe a touch more, but a good, good little catch and run here. Manning was in the uh, slot on that play, it looked like. Ball placed on the 28. Here's a quick pitch out here to the near side. It's going to be Kepler trying to get around the corner. Makes the turn and now is pushed out of bounds. They're going to keep the clock running. He was just shy of the 25. They'll spot it on about the 26 yard line. So not as much as we thought he ran a long ways for two yards. Basketball doing a nice job of extending that play. Somebody right away got in on that one. I did not catch the number. For Boscobel. Well, let's see what's going on here now with a second down situation. Second and seven. Brown in motion, dropping back, firing downfield. It's going for Brown, it is knocked down. Well, Brown actually wound up playing a little defense. Uh, or actually, check that, it was Lincoln Manning. Whitaker stepped in front of him and Manning swatted away as it wound up in his hands. So nice job by Lincoln Manning. He could not make the catch, so he had to play defensive back. Here's a good snap, looking downfield, and, and it is incomplete. Looking for, looking for Lincoln Manning once again, but we do have a flag on the play. Chop block here. That's going to go on the Bulldogs of Ithaca. Tried to get the ball to Lincoln Manning on the little sprint down the middle of the field. Well, 
Well, let's take a look here. Third down. One says third, the other says fourth. So third and 16 now. The snap, looking, firing to the outside, and that's too much. Nelson a little too quick on that throw for Logan Anderson. They had the right idea if Logan could have gone a little further out, but the ball was already tossed. And now it's fourth and 16. Nine minutes to go in the ball game. Firing downfield, going for Manning, and it is incomplete. That one got through the hands of everybody and overshot, showing the arm strength there with Nelson. Basketball will take over. Basketball taking over here. Whitaker. Under some duress, now able to dodge one, two, but not the third and fourth. Coming in quickly. Bolin making a help with the stop here. Quick toss, oh nice job here by Logan Anderson. Got his hand in there just in time as uh, Bell was looking to make the grab and Anderson tipped it away. Another half a step and Anderson would have been into the end zone. And a timeout here now. I think we're gonna get, uh, yeah, we're gonna take a quick little timeout here. Uh, we'll be right back. Third and eight now for Boscobel. High snap. Whitaker able to pull it down and then tried to escape that rush. Hanging on to him was uh, Justin Honer. He would not let go. It's now fourth and a solid six. Clock now becoming uh, not so friendly here for Boscobel. But uh, Bell doing the quarterbacking, trying to get to the outside, and he is stopped. Maybe uh, maybe a half a yard pickup, but it's going to be a turnover on downs as Ithaca holds and they'll take over first and 10. Week number six here for both these teams. Handoff coming up here in a short game with uh, Kepler. Hill in on the stop. Clock moving down to the seven minute mark. As Ithaca will try to keep this one, I would, you would think, on the ground and chew up some time. And I would love to get some yardage as well. Here's a handoff trying to get to the outside. Turns back in and slipping underneath a tackle was Anderson. He ducked underneath Whitaker's tackle and right into the arms. I think that was, uh, might have been wetter. Not sure if it was Wetter or uh, Wayne in there on the stop. It's going to bring up a third and five now. You would imagine that Ithaca would look at two down territory here and try and burn more of that clock if at all possible.
Good snap, handoff, Anderson. It's got enough for the first down. Drag in a tackler with them. And that'll chew up some more yardage. On the tackle was Wayne, but he was kind of long for the ride for about four or five yards. And Ithaca now in good position here to run this clock out as we hit the 540 mark. Wind up running at least a couple more minutes, maybe three minutes off the clock here and with that first down. Nelson up the middle, stopped here. 75 and Trum along with uh, Bell. Anderson slips off the field. Bolin comes on. Turn the handoff. We've got a new back in here now, number 25 in Cole Brownlee. Brownlee moves the stick. Another yard or two here. Bring up a third and four now. They'll snap the ball under four minutes in this third down play. Brownlee with the ball again, moving forward. I tell you what, he is very close to the first down. Going to be just shy of it. It's going to go fourth and about, well, they're going to go two. I thought he was going to be at least a fourth and one situation, but not going to quite make that. Into the ball game, Jones with the play. Under three and a half to go. Well, a first down here with a fourth and two, they're gonna say long one, but they get a first down. Now they can really think about milking the clock. And there's a big time hit. But Nelson, enough momentum to get the first down. And now they can really look at working the clock here as we hit the three minute mark. Ithaca Bulldogs looking to try and pick up a shutout here on their homecoming festivities with the ball game. Moving, the, waiting for the clock here. They'll watch the official and now he starts to count. And as he does that, here's a run to the outside. This is a great shot. Oh, we're gonna get a flag here. Let's see what happens here. The two basketball players really smack into each other. It does go against Ithaca though from the uh, preliminary call. That was Bell and uh, one of his teammates in there. I'm sure that might have been 24 in Wayne colliding, trying to make that stop. Well, against the Ithaca squad, they'll step that one off and restart the clock. Ithaca have been hampered with some penalties here today. That's something I'm sure Coach Steve Olson will address in next week's practice sessions. We're at the two minute mark now.
Handoff, Brownlee trying to get to the outside and he is swamped over there with uh, Boscobel coming in. That was uh, Whitaker once again. Coming up over the top, number 53 in Jilson. Also creating some problems there. And we're going to be sitting at a second and 12 now, a couple yard loss. I think they're going to take a look for a timeout here as Coach Steve Olson walking over to Bruce Kaiser, the line judge. And now a timeout taken here by Ithaca with 101 to go in the ball game. Ithaca out in front, 26 nothing. Ithaca coming off the timeout here, 101 to go. The clock will start on the snap, second and 12. And taking a knee was Nelson. And they'll look to Move the clock down to 40 seconds. They do line up here. We'll see if they can wait. They'll wait a little bit longer here. Now they'll go at 35 and take the snap. And that should take care of things as they reset. And once they reset the ball, the clock, that's what will happen. They'll run this one out now as the two teams will meet. The center of the field here, we want to congratulate Boscobel and Ithaca for the ball game here today. And congratulations to Ithaca, their 100th fair and homecoming festivities. They pick up the win, 26 nothing here over Boscobel. And uh, just a real nice showing here for both of the Bulldog teams. Well, we hope you've enjoyed watching us. Western Wisconsin video production of Ithaca Bulldog football action here and the uh, 100th annual Ithaca Fair. So long, everyone. Ken Manning saying we'll see you real soon somewhere out there on the gridiron.